subscribe and let's get into this man i went freaking hard gizmo's gadgets goodies right. gym homies call me another hitter and the freaking weights were my voice gizmo's gadgets gizmo's gadgets goodies let's get into this man you're a convicted fuck with a little bit of dancing gizmo's gadgets goodies right. gym homie gdh homie another hitter hard hitter <laughs> Gizmos, gadgets, gizmos, gadgets, goodies. Let's get into this. What up, what up? It's Garage Gym, homie. And today, I'm reviewing After Dark Pyrodex Thermogenic. Is it worth it? Before we get into this here, please click the subscribe button. I got content coming out every day for you. So click subscribe and let's get into this man hey man god is amazing homie you know every every once in a while i get a comment from from somebody and they say something which doesn't feel positive they say you know uh i like the review but i skip the god talk or uh you know i don't believe in fairy tales or any of that listen man there's a fact right here i'm gonna give it to you i wouldn't even be doing these dang reviews if it weren't for God, homie, I'd be strung out on heroin in the streets of LA, probably dead by now, for sure dead by now. This is nine years, almost nine years after I got sober, there's no way that I'd still be alive the way I was running, man. So how am I not going to be true to myself, man? I'm not going to start a chance. I started the chance. God's number one, homie. So I'm not going to say, what, are these supplements are number one and God is last? God it doesn't exist. God is everything to me, homie. You, you make a choice in your life. God is either everything or nothing. When, I, when I'm an alcoholic, man, a drug addict, and I want to recover, I had to make a choice that God is every. I can't do the 12 steps without God, or else I'm just left with myself. If you pull God out of all the 12 steps, all you're left with is you, homie, and I know where that got me. So listen, man, I'm just here to be true to myself. If you don't like it, I love you, man. I'm just appreciative that you're here, man. I don't care if you like the God talk or you just like the reviews. I'm just... I'm grateful you gave me a minute of your time, man. So God bless you. I love you, man. I appreciate you. I even appreciate the, the comment that doesn't feel positive, man. But I'm going to be true to myself, man. Let's be true to ourselves today, man. Live from here. Stay out of here. Let's get down to business. I reviewed their um, Inhuman pre-workout. And that boy was a hitter right there, man. That was a nice DMHA head buzz feel good pre-workout man nice high with it nice source quality ingredients this is sick right here you can't even see i wish you could see there's like in the background of this, this is sick man and before i forget oh it says be the monster you effing love the pain there's a lot of fear no I can't even read it. There's a lot. This is a sick label. Let's put it that way. There's a lot number, so let's hope it's legit. Yeah, and dude, these pills are dope. Look at these, man. Look at these pills, homie. We're going to study the label together. Very intimidating. How sick is that? I mean, these are dope, man. Look at that little... Can you see it? Look at that little bunny. I like that, man. They got the logo on there. That's Those are probably the, some of the coolest pills I've ever seen, man. So anyway... Let's get down to business. Quit monkeying around. Start pumping some freaking iron. Here we go, son. If you like what I have to say about this here, I might tell you it's trash, man. You get it from subkings.com. Discount code GGH15 to knock some big cash off. That's who sent it to me. So I give them the love, homie. I give them the love. Let's talk about the facts. They're giving you 60 uh, capsules in a container, and it's uh, 30 servings per container. Two-capsule hitter right here. So giving you vitamin B3, B6, B12, iodine. Here's the meat and potatoes, homie. Rage and energy complex. Delayed release caffeine matrix, 400 milligrams. Caffeine anhydrous, dicaffeine malate, microencapsulated caffeine. So it looks like three kinds of caffeine, uh, yielding 375 milligrams of caffeine. Nice amount of caffeine, man. It's a high stim hitter. 220 milligrams of DMHA, they're claiming, man. Two amino. Is this that Juglins, Regia, ICP, America's Most Wanted, English Walnut, UK Trash DMHA? Or is this that higher than vagina 
uh, lab made, lab leak, uh, Fauci DMHA, man. We're gonna find out. Theobromine, hydrochloride, 100 milligrams. Nice uh, cousin to caffeine. Uh, it gives you some mood, some focus, yada, yada. Sinopharin, 50 milligrams. Hortonine, homie, 30 milligram, another stimulant. So they're giving you a few kinds of caffeine and four other stimulants besides it. Then they're claiming this ephedra extract, 50 milligram, which is a BS ingredient. Uh, thermo GBB, so that's gamma, 15 milligrams. I like that amount, man. I don't like more than 25. It, I don't like sweating after I train, man. I like to sweat while I train, then shower up and not sweat anymore. So 15 is a solid amount. Grains of paradise, 10 milligrams. Cocobuterol, great ingredient, 10 milligrams. Then you got this dandelion root, 100 milligrams, so that gets wa excess water out. DMA, 75 milligrams, more, more focus. Juniper berry, 50 milligrams. I don't know what it really does, but it's, I guess it's kind of a feel-good hitter that pairs well. I don't really know if there's legitimacy to it, but some of the supplements I've taken that I really like have juniper berry. And you know, himbine hydrochloride, three milligrams. That's for the schlong gains, man, for the fat-burning property, for the uh, heart rate action, a little energy. Yo, himbine, man, for blood flow. It's good for you, man. Uh, so this is a freaking sick label, homie. This is very similar to their pre-workout. I mean, on label, they, you got the same kind of caffeine, the same amount of DMHA, uh, and then some fat burning properties. Man, don't let the industry fool you, homie. Fat burners and pre-workouts, it's all the same thing, homie. You got a fat burner. Ooh, here's a couple thermogenic ingredients. We're a fat burner. Oh, here's uh, some stims with a few pump ingredients. Now it's a pre-work. It's all the same stuff, man. It's a bunch of, it's a bunch of stimulants and energy and yada, yada. So listen, man, let's get down to business. I took the pills, man. I did. I came down to the dance floor. It's time for some iron pumping, son. Um, so what I did was I actually mixed this with a pump formula. I'm not going to tell you which one, but it was just because I'm going to review it this week. It was just a straight up pump formula, no nootropics, nothing except pumps, homie. And I went hard on the iron, man. So this is what I'll say, man. This is a very, this is a very, um, this is what I'm going to say, this is what I'm going to say about this, homie. <laughs> First of all, I like the experience with it. I thought it was a very, I liked how it felt. Now, let me just give it to you straight, man, because I ain't here shining no dang schlongs. This is a very smooth experience and a very feel-good supplement. Um, so you take it, and it takes about 20 minutes before you feel anything. And that's usually uh, how pills are, you know. They don't hit as quick as powders generally, in my experience. So it takes 20 minutes before you feel anything, homie. Then you feel some smooth energy, some awakeness. Between 20 and 35 minutes, you're kind of wondering if this has the goods in it. I spent the next, after I felt the energy at 20 minutes after ingesting it, because I, I, I keep an eye on the watch for you so I can be kind of surgical with these reviews. I spent between the next 15 minutes wondering, does this have the goods? Is it just how it's gonna stay? Because it was just kind of consistent at that point. Between 30 and 35 minutes after ingesting it, I felt the mental aspect come in. So this was a very, it had a very feel good property where I started dancing. I said, I got, I turned on Buster Rhymes, that Genesis album, let it play all the way through. Um, the, there was no point where your heart's going crazy or anything. It was very, very smooth the, and consistent the entire way through. Now at about 35 minutes in, you say to yourself, yeah, I got kind of a high. Now, let me just explain what I mean. There's definitely, you could tell it has, it doesn't feel super illicit. I'm gonna put it that way. This does not feel the same. At 220 milligrams of DMHA does not feel the same as their pre-workout at 220 milligrams of DMHA. I don't wanna say that the experience falls short of the label. It doesn't match up to what you might, you might see this label and be like, man, I'm gonna be hoarding cinephrine. My heart rate's gonna be up. I'm gonna be higher than giraffe vagina. It wasn't really like that, homie. It's just a very feel good energy that holds you. I think it would be better for cardio if you wait about 30 minutes, 20, if you wait about 20 minutes before doing your cardio, like I wouldn't take this and immediately do your cardio. 
is probably better for cardio than pumping iron. It's not, it doesn't have like a super backbone to it. It's a smooth, very feel good energy that holds you. So there's definitely nothing to be scared of. I would say if you wanna talk about the PP tingle scale and the DMHA apparentness, how apparent that DMHA is, it's like a four or five, you know, like a four, it, like it's there, like you could tell it's there and you got kind of a good buzz, you're, you're floating through your training, you're forgetting kind of like what music's playing, you're dancing a little, you have a very, it, it elevates your mood, but it's not crazy in any department. I mean, the energy is not over the top, you're not like, oh, I'm so energized, you're not like super happy, you're definitely not euphoric, it's just, and you're not like tunnel vision focused. However, I'm not saying anything bad, it, has each one of those elements in a pretty mild aspect. So it's a mild supplement, man. It doesn't, the energy is not stim junkie. The mental aspect teeters on stim junkie. It just doesn't feel super illicit, but the DMHA is there, homie. And the stims are, I don't know about all these other stims or whatever, but there's definitely DMHA. And it feels clean, homie. It doesn't feel, it feels like good DMHA, just not, like, it just doesn't feel like there's a ton of it. Maybe it doesn't feel like the 220 milligrams of DMHA. There's just enough to like tell it's there. So this would be really good for cardio, not as good for pumping iron, better for a cardio pre-workout for me, man. So if you just need like that little extra, you want some illicit feeling, some extra focus, some mood or whatever, I thought it's a solid supplement. I just didn't think it felt exactly how the label suggested, but not in a bad way, man. I didn't walk away like pissed off or disappointed or anything like that, man. It was just a different experience than I anticipated after using their pre-workout. So I thought it was solid, man. It was definitely nice and uh, it didn't feel unhealthy. That's the other thing I'll say about it. So it felt a lot healthier than their pre-workout. Just a nice, smooth, feel good energy that lasts a few hours, man. I mean, there's nothing negative about it. It didn't crush your appetite. Um, your, your pee pee might even work later, man. If you got a right swipe or two, I doubt you did, homie, knowing you. But that's what I got to say, man. I'm just here to give it to you straight. Solid fat burner. Got, the, got some goods in it. And uh, I look forward to seeing more of what this company's putting out. Because I, I think they do use quality sourced ingredients. I, it didn't feel like 220 milligrams of DMHA, but whatever DMHA was in there felt really clean um, and good, man. So I did feel really good on it. That's what I got. Garage Gym homies, always going to give it to you straight. Was this review choppy or did I break it down properly? God bless all you together. Let's get this dang muscle. I'm out.